I don't know about you, but I really despise it when people decide to add game breaking mechanics or weapons into the game to where you just become the most overpowering person of all time and it just disgusts. I'm not trying to hate on the mace here, but let's be real here. This mace is absolutely disgusting. Now, I love the idea. Don't get me wrong. The idea is absolutely amazing and the mechanics are beautiful. The enchantments are pretty cool. So how much is too powerful for a weapon in Minecraft? Is it a one tap? Is it a two tap? Or is that perfectly fine? Are you able to one shot the ender dragon and just say okay that's not too powerful it's balanced if you're able to basically one shot the ender dragon or even the warden you might as well just go to creative slash and boom he's dead hold up Oh. Is Mojang trying to make a weapon that's so powerful it breaks the game entirely? Because this weapon has an enchantment called density, which is equal to sharpness for a sword or an axe. So it increases the damage. Great. Okay, whatever. But then we also got an armor penetrating enchantment called Breach. This enchantment goes through your armor and deals insane damage. Penetrate the enemy armor with Breach. Because now it's not even, you have no clothes on. You have no armor. You're, you're just instantly getting shot. So I don't understand what is going on here. And then on top of that, we also have a third enchantment called Wind Burst, which allows you essentially to combo your attacks to be able to go mm, over and over and the mm, again, over and over to just combo stack the damage, which is a pretty cool idea. I'm not going to lie, but what are we doing here? Again, I'm not trying to hate on this bad boy because there's probably a reason and I'm gonna discuss that in about three seconds one two three Okay, there's probably a new boss coming to minecraft Stop the cap. now that is a crazy theory I'm not gonna lie, but I will say this it's an idea What if this new boss has like a certain amount of armor or health that it won't matter how much damage you do with the mace? It's still going to require you to take a lot more time to damage this guy because he's gonna have so much hp or her have so much hp and defense that it won't matter if you have stack every single enchantment onto that mace this guy maybe he has anti-penetrable flesh i don't know maybe the breach won't even work because he has anti armor breaking stats something like that. i don't know my other thought is what about the deep dark portal I inside the portal what if we go to a new dimension and the ward what if the warden is literally just an average guy like his hp and damage is average in this new dimension the boss in there is maybe three or four times more hp defense and damage than the warden let me know down in the comments because I i'm starting to freak out because this is just like like, it's game breaking, bro. It's game breaking, but it, at the same time, it's kind of exciting because could we possibly have a new challenge ahead of us? I'm always down for a new challenge. That's something I love. I still remember when Hardcore came out for the first time. I was so excited. I tried it. I died immediately, but hey, I was still really excited for that. And heck, honestly, I still die in Hardcore. Let's be real here. Then, of course, there is also the end update, which last week I made a video on that. You guys were saying that the Minecraft Dungeons Enderman could possibly be shown in vanilla minecraft i, I technically d disagreed at the beginning of it in fact i did but after giving it some thought it is possible a lot of you guys said that it was confirmed that disc 5 from vanilla minecraft actually had sounds that were confirmed to be from the dlc in Minecraft Dungeons. So as a result, it is very, very possible that we could see these other types of Endermen or heck, these other Ender creatures. I don't know what was in there because I never played the DLC, but uh, you guys did. And so I thank you for the feedback because pfft, I, I had no idea. All, all I did was look at the trailer. <laughs> anyway, if there is a new end update that comes, say it's for the 1.22 update, it's very possible that these Endermen could be overpowered. Like these guys could be super strong, maybe even more strong than the Ender Dragon. It, it makes it balanced then, especially if you had that combo ability I don't know what I was doing there. With the wind burst, for example, say one of the new Endermen teleports like crazy, way more than the regular Endermen. And so it kind of forces you, well, I guess, have a new strategy. You won't be able to just combo over and over because this guy's teleporting all around you. You might not be able to hit your shots. So 
I know I, I went crazy on this one, but it is important because I don't want the game to be broken. I have always wanted a game to have like different options of weapons, different types of weapons. And when this first came out, when the mace first was released, I thought, okay, this is a brand new weapon. You need kind of some skill to be able to actually perfect the weapon. This is going to be good. But after seeing, especially the enchantments and how much damage it does by default, I started getting worried like crazy. And so my only thought is Mojang is preparing us for something preparing us for something big maybe a new hardcore I, you never know you never know I, I, insane mode maybe i only say that because they do have hardcore mode for the bedrock edition now so now it's in parity and so now they could end up maybe keeping that parity by increasing the level even more to insane mode or, or i don't know that's probably my imagination talking but let me know down in the comments do you think a new difficulty could possibly be released i also want to know your thoughts on the whole mace is it actually overpowering or am i just going psycho here leave a like and subscribe for more minecraft content like this